Hello, thank you so much for coming back to watch this week's hair care review. So I have a little bit of a different product today. This is the Love Beauty and Planet Shampoo Bar. So if you'd like to hear about this product and my first impressions review, then please keep on watching. Just so you know, I do upload a daily video here on this channel all about budget beauty. So it can be a hair care item, it can be skincare, fragrance, makeup. It really does depend on the day of the week. So make sure you do subscribe, hit that notification bell, bookmark the page. That way you can come on back and watch whenever you would like to. I also do a live stream every single day of the week, Monday through Saturday. It is at 12.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and on Sundays it is at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So come hang out. I'd love to get to know you. Okay, you'll have to excuse my look. It's late. I'm ready to go jump in the tub. And yeah, I picked up this Love, Beauty, and Planet um, shampoo bar. So it's like a bar of shampoo. That's pretty much what it is. So this is from Unilever. Um, it has um, no um, no sulfates, no silicones, parabens, or dyes, and it has no phthalates, and it's also not tested on animals. And the package is made with 100% recyclable um, materials. So um, this did come opened, so, but oh my gosh, this stuff smells amazing. So. This so is what it looks like. It's just a little heart-shaped bar, and it's pretty heavy. So it is four ounces, but it's, um, yeah, we're just going to go in and try it out. I'm super excited, but this is Muru Muru Butter and Rose, and it is for blooming color. So it is for vibrancy for color-treated hair. It is safe for my color-treated hair, which I'm super happy. I'm so greasy. It's gross, but I'm excited to try this out, but yeah, I'm excited. So yeah, um, a lot of people, they like this sort of thing because there's no shampoo bottles or anything like that, so I thought I'd give it a go, plus it's super affordable, less than $2 on Amazon. I'll link it down below for you, but I'm going to go jump in the tub. We're going to try this out. I'm going to go ahead and film me trying it, and then I'll come back with my first impressions review, so let's go ahead and get in the tub. Hello there, so I had to get all that makeup off. I just had to, but here I have the Love Beauty and Planet Shampoo Bar. It really does smell amazing, so just supposed to get it wet. I'm trying to find the camera, I'm sorry. You're just supposed to get it wet and lather it and then apply it to your hair. So we're gonna try it. Here we go. So weird. This is really, really weird. Add a little bit more water. Okay. It's finally starting to lather up. It really does smell so good. Okay. Let's try it. almost feels like a Dove Beauty Bar. If you've ever kind of felt how a Dove Beauty Bar feels, that's kind of what it feels like. So. Seems to be a little bit lower sudsing than a traditional shampoo. This doesn't have any um, sulfate or phthalates or anything like that in it, which is usually pretty normal. Okay, so I'm not going to condition my hair. I just really, it's like my ends are getting any soap on them, which the ends are the driest, so it probably doesn't matter. Um, but, yeah, anyway, so I'm not gonna condition it. It feels pretty moisturizing, so I will see you when I get out, but yeah. Okay, so, just got out of the tub. I did not condition my hair, but let's go ahead and try to comb this out. I usually do condition. I just was curious to see if it was very moisturizing. 
my hair would definitely be easier to comb through if I would have conditioned, but it's honestly not too bad. I think if you have really long hair, you would definitely need to condition. Still smell a little bit of scent on my hair. So, yeah, um, next time I use this, I will definitely, oh man, hair fall out. I will definitely condition it. It's not like super tangly. I've used some shampoos that leaves your hair like really knotted and messy. This isn't like that. So, but yeah. Okay, so while I finish combing this out, I'm going to go ahead and start my little review on the uh, Love Beauty and Planet Bar Shampoo. I think it's a really cool concept. I had, I've heard of bar shampoos before, but I've never tried one. Um, I definitely do see the um, good parts of it. You know, not having a bottle. Um, you know, the box is made out of recyclable, recycled material. You can recycle the box and yeah, you don't have to worry about a plastic bottle. So, I think that is really, really cool. Um, it's not difficult to use. I, it's pretty much the same as shampoo. It did take a little while. It did take a little bit longer than, you know, a traditional shampoo to get a lather started, but it is sulfate free and phthalate free, which can, you know, that can kind of reduce sudsing. So, I'm, I don't really think that really has to do with anything it, with it being a bar. Um, but yeah, I mean, I like it. My hair feels very dry though. Like, very, very dry. Hmm. Which is weird, because it has that Muru Muru butter in it. I would think that it would have been a little bit more moisturizing. Um, but let's see. So this has sodium, cocal, isolinate, stearic acid, water, sodium, isolinate, fragrance, coconut oil, alcohol. So, oof. Um, even though it doesn't have sulfate or phthalates or parabens and all that, it still has some pretty harsh chemicals in it, which to be fair, most shampoo and conditioner does. Um, so yeah, hopefully it won't strip color, or it is sulfate free and phthalate free and everything, so. But no, I think this is pretty cool. They are plant-based ingredients, which is awesome. Um, so yeah, so far I, I do like the Love Beauty and Planet um, shampoo bar. It's pretty cool, and I think if you are a little bit more of an environmentalist, if you are trying to produce less trash maybe, or just trying to reduce your plastic use, then yeah, I think this would be a cool product. It smells really, 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 really good. Like, really good. I They need to come out with a scent that smells like this because it smells so good. So yeah, um, definitely use it with conditioner next time, but my hair feels clean, um, and I think it's a good product. I will definitely continue to use it, um, but as of right now, I think I still prefer my... Um, power stick, pure, sulfate free color protection shampoo from the Dollar Tree. That stuff is amazing and about the same price for shampoo and conditioner. So, but yeah, I do like it. It's a good product and I do recommend it. I, like I said, I will link it down below for you in just in case you're interested. They did have a whole bunch of different kinds. They didn't just have the color vibrancy one. So, there we go, but um, I hope you did enjoy this week's hair care review. If you did, please go ahead and give the video a thumbs up and share it, hair in my mouth. Okay, sorry about that. Yeah, go ahead and share the video, I'd appreciate it. Leave a comment down below. Have you ever used a shampoo bar? What did you think of it? Did you like it? Did it work for you? Let me know down below in the comments. And let's see. Just so you know, I do have another channel. It's called Gourmet on a Budget. It's all about budget food, and I upload on that one seven days a week as well. 
Um, so recipes and taste tests and little shopping trips. So make sure you do go and subscribe if you would like to. I would appreciate it. And just so, so you know, I would totally love it if you would follow me on my other, other social media. Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's all about your glam babe. Don't go anywhere quite yet. Another video should start autoplaying here very shortly. Or you can always click on one of the ones that will be popping up around the screen. But yeah, I'll see you here in just a sec.